Hi, let's look into the another important section of the 5G call flow and the different identifiers that are present at the UE as well as at the network level. We are going to cover different topics in this particular section. We'll look into what are the different procedures that are there for the registration of the user in a network. We'll also look into what are the different flow of a call in a 5G network right from the UE to the radio access network and then to the core network. We'll see that how initially user is accessing to the network and how it gets registered to the network. We'll look into the different kind of registration procedures that are possible in 5G. We'll then also look into the deregistration procedure, how the user will get deregistered from the network. There are different identifiers, right, from the user and the subscriber identities to the different network identities that are available in the 5G. And this will help to further make sure to provide the services in an appropriate manner. So we'll look into those identities also in detail in this particular section.